Hey everyone, AC30 here. Uh, welcome back. This is the fifth episode of my YouTube series teaching you how to set up and use the YagPDB Discord bot. In this episode, we're going to be covering the moderation module of the bot. To get started, let's click on Tools and Utilities in the sidebar, and then Moderation. YagPDB has great options for moderating your server. It has plugins for muting, kicking, banning, and even a full warning system. On the General tab, we can set a mod log channel and also a reporting channel. And in this case, we're going to be enabling report commands and clean commands, as well as logging unban events, bans not made through the bot, and enabling the give role and allowing owners and admins to use those plugins. And logging that to the mod log as well. And so we've just created a mod log channel in Discord, which only staff have access to and the bots. So now let's go back and set that as both the mod log and the reports channel. And now all of the moderator actions will be logged to this channel on the Discord server. Next, we'll move to the mute plugin and we'll enable it and we'll need to set the mute role. To do this, simply go back to your server, create a new role called muted or whatever. It doesn't matter what you name it. Save that and go back into the panel, refresh the page and then click the role. We'll have the bot manage the mute role just to make it easy for us, which means we don't have to do any setup. All we have to do is create that role and the bot will do the rest for us. Next, we'll allow users with the role owner, admin, and mod to use the mute commands. We'll remove the role currently streaming from people who are muted, just in case they have that, and we'll make the unmute reason optional. This can change depending on how you want your server set up and it's all personal preference. Next, the kick plugin. We'll enable this and we'll give owner, admin, and mod permissions to kick. I will not enable the option to delete the user's last 100 messages on kick, but you can if you would like. And I will make the reason mandatory by not checking this box. Next, the ban plugin. And again, we'll enable this and we'll only allow owners and admins to use this one. We will make the reason mandatory by leaving this box unchecked. Next, the warnings plugin. We'll enable this and people, owner, admin, mod, will be able to use this command. And we will also send warnings to the mod log. On this page, we also have options to delete all warnings and clicking this button will bring up a dialog box which gives you two options, cancel and delete them all. If you click delete them all, it cannot be undone. You will permanently delete all of your warnings and there's no way to revert this change. Let's cancel and save our changes. And now moderation is set up. That's all for this video. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, be sure to leave a like and feel free to comment down below with any questions you may have and I'll be sure to get to as many of them as I possibly can. If you have further questions, feel free to join the support server at ac30.com slash and the link is also in the description down below. Thanks guys.